pleasant to the ears, but visually devastating. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today, we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 good songs with stupid music videos. For this list, we're looking at songs we consider to be worth listening to, but that were tainted with absolutely dreadful music videos. For example, while we do consider the Bad Touch by the Bloodhound Gang to be an utterly stupid video, we also consider the song to be as such. And so, you won't be finding it on our list. Enjoy! Number 10, Paradise, Coldplay. When she was just a girl, she expected the world. It was a huge hit in 2011, so what in the hell went wrong with the music video? Life goes on, it gets so heavy. Well, it's never a good thing when the director receives only one day's notice, which is what happened when Matt Whitecross stepped in to direct Paradise. Clearly under the impression that it's always cute when grown men wear animal outfits, lead singer Chris Martin roamed about the gorgeous South African landscapes before teaming up with his fellow bandmates. While the song is arguably one of Coldplay's most beautifully anthemic, the video no doubt has us scratching our heads. Number 9, Holiday, Madonna. Have you ever just set up a camera in your room and rocked the heck out to your favorite song? Well, for this Madonna track, she did basically that. We need a holiday. Resulting in a stripped down two camera production that may or may not have been shot in someone's basement. Yes, it's one of the best dance songs of all time, however, the music video raises a few intriguing questions. Have the background dancers been sedated? And who is that creep in the background? We will find to come together. In the end, Madonna produced a visual document of definitive 80s dancing, but should she have? Number 8, E.T. Katy Perry featuring Kanye West. I got a dirty mind, I got filthy ways, I'm trying to bathe my A in your Milky Way. It's no secret that sexuality has been a key ingredient to Katy Perry's success, but this time around, she silenced all raging hormones with a slightly insane music video featuring Yeezy himself. They calling me an alien, a big headed astronaut. With the film Avatar playing as the video's inspiration, director Floria Sigismondi capitalized on the otherworldly trend with a combination of visuals that lack cohesiveness and innovation. but did include Kanye West floating around aimlessly. Maybe Kanye was just trying to live up to Beyonce's best music video of all time. Number 7. Gooey, Glass Animals You know how some people don't like the word moist? Well, the Oxford band Glass Animals expanded on this concept with their video for Gooey, in which a sexed up group of individuals exchange fluids, seemingly for the sake of art. The song alone could put one into a beautiful trance, however, the Caravaggio-like music video could put one into a deep state of shock, thanks to a saliva torture scene. two men grappling around with ill-fitting leotards, a grown-up Velma from Scooby-Doo, and a Rubenesque redhead, the message seems to be, taste the goo. We'll pass. Number 6. Radioactive. Imagine Dragons. I'm waking up to ash and dust. 
eyes. I wipe my brow and I sweat my rug. If you haven't heard of this song, congratulations on coming out of your coma. Radioactive first hit the charts in 2012 and conjures up images of a post-apocalyptic world. But Imagine Dragons imagined something more surrealistic for the music video. Underground puppet fighting. Oh, and 80 star Lou Diamond Phillips. Yes, this happened. And among the chaos of a music video walks the blue-eyed bombshell Alexandria Daddario, who will either save Imagine Dragons from the madness, or perhaps feed them to the psychotic animals. It's purely subjective, yet undeniably asinine. Number 5. I'm Still Standing. Elton John. You can never know what it's like. Your blood like when a fuse is just like us. Filmed in the south of France, the original video for I'm Still Standing was almost lost after director Russell Mulcahy fell into the sea on the first day of shooting. I got a taste of love in a simple way. And if you need to know while I'm still standing, you just fade away. If he had, the world wouldn't have to endure images of dancing with the stars Bruno Tonioli and his aggressive camel toe. It's unclear what exactly Elton John is trying to say with this video, but given the various accounts of him being completely wasted during the shoot, the entire fiasco starts to make sense. Number 4. If I could turn back time, share. If I could turn back time, if I could find a way. Believe it or not, MTV actually banned this video in 1989, mainly because of Cher's exposed butt cheeks. If I could reach the stars, troubling as that may be to some viewers, more troubling is that her 12 year old son appeared in the music video, supporting her on guitar. If I could turn back time. Filmed on the USS Missouri, the US Navy must have been a tiny bit surprised when Cher showed up on set with her junk hanging out. But hey, what are you gonna do? Let the woman do her thing. Okay, maybe Cher's chart-topping singles haven't always been visually stimulating. Just look at her 1998 hit, Believe. Number 3. Separate Ways, Worlds Apart, Journey. With the arrival of MTV in the early 80s, rock bands could typically earn a larger following through dynamic music videos. But in this case, a beloved 80s band took an ill-advised journey in the form of a visual train wreck. Pick your poison. It might be the fashion or perhaps the outlandish posturing of Steve Perry. But while these errors can be forgiven over time, nobody can forgive the devastating display of air instruments. Ultimately, the synchronized headshot sums it all up as the faces of Journey convey their inner turmoil and realization of the lasting effects. Number 2. Total Eclipse of the Heart, Bonnie Tyler. Directed by Russell Mulcahy, the man responsible for Elton John's I'm Still Standing, the music video featured Welsh singer Bonnie Tyler in a room full of candles and dubs. Every now and then I fall apart. Among other things, you know, like a creepy kid and male swimmers for some reason. And Ever. And if you hold me, hold me tight. It's 
probably best if we all agree to forget this video, as the 5 minutes of imagery will surely ruin anyone's day, and certainly their memories of the song. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Even when we're smart and out of fear, let's go down to the tennis court and talk it up like yeah. Out on the edge, I'm blurry, and I'm hanging on a moment with you. Number one, Rock Me Tonight, Billy Squire. Back in the early 80s, Billy Squire conceived the premise of his infamous hit while swimming the waters of Greece, which may or may not have caused severe brain damage given the unfortunate sequence of events that followed. It's not necessarily the pole dancing or the plethora of pink of Rock Me Tonight, it's the fact that Billy Squire seems at odds with the concept of dancing itself, which is made abundantly clear throughout the five brutal minutes. Just as the sun rises with each morning, this psychologically damaging experience will always sit atop the mountain of miserable music videos. So, do you agree with our selections? What is your favorite good song with a stupid music video? For more mind-blowing top 10s published daily, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com.